arithmetic reasoning practice test question for the ASVAB and PyCat says, a decorator removes equal sized corners from a rectangle or piece of fabric to create a tablecloth as shown in the illustration. What is the area of the tablecloth? So I'm gonna show you how to solve this one two different ways. Uh, the first way is gonna be the most common way to solve this one. And the second way is gonna be the less common way to solve this one. So for the first way, we're trying to find the area of the tablecloth. Uh, that said, we know that we're going to have the area of, of a rectangle. And from that, we're going to subtract four times the area of one of these triangular corners. Why four? Because we have four identical triangular corners. We have one here, second one here, third one here, and a fourth one here. All right, what is the area of a rectangle? It's length times width minus four times. What is the area of a triangle? It's one half base times height. Let's find these values. What is the length of our rectangle? Again, if this is three, then this part right here is also gonna be three. So its length is gonna be three plus three or six. So this becomes six times. What is its width? Again, of that part's four, this part right here is also gonna be four. So its width is gonna be four plus four or eight. So this becomes six times eight minus four times one half. What is the base of our triangle? Again, we're talking about this triangle right here. Its base is right here. It's gonna be three. What is its height? Its height is right here. It's gonna be four. All right, so let's work this out. This is six times eight, which is 48 minus, what is four times one half? That's just gonna be two. What is three times four? That is 12. What is 48 minus two times 12 is 24. 48 minus 24 is gonna be 24. So the area of this tablecloth is C, 24 square feet. All right, let's take a look at the second method. For the second method, we have to realize that our tablecloth is in the shape of a rhombus. The formula to find the area of a rhombus is gonna be diagonal one times diagonal two all over two. All right, so let's go ahead and do that. Here's diagonal one, it's the distance from here to here. We can see that that is gonna be three plus three. So diagonal one here is gonna be six. So this becomes six times. Diagonal two is the distance from here to here. That's gonna be four plus four. So diagonal two is gonna be eight. This becomes six times eight over two. This is 48 divided by two, which is 24. So regardless of how you solve this one, you get the same result. The incorrect way to solve this one is to use the Pythagorean theorem to say that this piece right here is five and to assume that this is a square. So you're gonna say the area is five times five or 25 square feet. This is a rhombus, not a square.